up with water. It's not working, so I'm gonna use this 100% organic oil, uh, coconut oil, and I'm just gonna glob it on, and I'm gonna warm it up in my hands before I put it on my face. And I'm just gonna glob it all over my face. And I find that because obviously it's so oily, it just sticks to every kind of makeup you could think of, and it makes it all come off. And so since there's residue, I'm gonna use these Walmart or CVS or Walgreens brand makeup remover wipes just to get off any leftover. And I'm gonna wash that off. Now I'm gonna use my Cetaphil that I've used since forever ago because I just feel like it extra cleans. It's got macadamia oil in it, which is really good for your skin. Hold on a minute. I'm gonna get this conditioner by Garnier called Hold Blends. I didn't show y'all, but I actually had purple shampoo on my hair while I was getting off my makeup. So now I'm gonna let this conditioner sit on my head. Um, yeah. So now while the conditioner is sitting on my head, I'm going to use this St. Ives Apricot Scrub. I just find that that really gets my pores nice and clean and whatever else is left over. This is the Warm Vanilla Sugar from Bath & Body Works Body Wash. It smells edible. It is amazing. I want to eat it. Um, yeah, so I washed my body and my hair and yeah. So that is how I remove my makeup every single day. Um, even if it's not theatrical, even if I have hardly any on, because it just makes my skin feel really clean. 